I'm Sherry Cizo. I'm the Senior Director for the Clinical Practice Group at DACO. It is Autism Acceptance Month, and I have my son Owen here with me. He's 20 years old, and he's on the autism spectrum. We thought it would be really helpful to maybe tell some stories about his healthcare and how it was a little bit difficult when he was younger. Even though I'm a provider, it was very difficult to get him properly diagnosed and also difficult to get him the therapy that he needed because of the lack of providers that are available. In addition, any routine change is very difficult for him and was even more difficult when he was younger. So I don't know if you wanna to talk, Ellen, a little bit about some of the experiences that you had when you were younger and getting healthcare. Yeah, hi, I'm Owen. Um, I wanna just talk about a little bit about my experiences. I mean, I really struggled at first with doctors. I really didn't feel comfortable, especially with new people. And um, I needed my service dog, Reina, at first to be with me, to feel comfortable with the doctors and my parents to be with me. So if I had somebody come to my house like Doc Go, it would have been very helpful. Yes, it would have really reduced stress and limited the chance of a meltdown. Even today, changes in routines are very difficult. Uh, in addition, it's just very expensive to get to the doctor sometimes and the financial toxicity associated with therapy for autism is really significant for a lot of families. And if we could have done all that at home, that would have been great, right up? Oh yeah. Yeah. So we really think DACO is, is a place to go to get urgent care and other healthcare services for any individual on the spectrum, but especially Owen. <laughs>